in the message. Give the good stuff. We're supposed to say that for emergencies. Uh, what do you think this is? Mr. Drake, Chairman commends your efforts out here on the border. You're on a tight ship. I don't need his compliments. I need food, weapons. The board feels your rations are appropriate for your population and your climate. They're a joke, but people are starving. Hmm. You see, some unscrupulous mayors in these border towns hoard rations. They keep themselves and their deputies well fed while the rest starve. But I'm sure you're not one of those. Of course not. Over the next year, all citizens are to be identified, evaluated, and issued a rank. Believe me, Mr. Drake, there are advantages to having a high rank. What did you want? As I said, to evaluate your usefulness to the ULC, we've repeatedly ordered you to capture a criminal in your territory called the Shepherd. You make it sound easy. It's not. Regardless, this man is a high priority to the chairman and must be apprehended. We will not give this order again. Is that a threat? Of course it is. If you fail to deliver the shepherd to us, you will be replaced. You have one week. You're him, aren't you? One they always talk about from up north. They say you never lose a fight. 
Wish that were true. I'm cold. Would you pray for me? No need. I'm gonna get you patched up. That place says God doesn't listen to our prayers anymore. Ever since the day. But maybe he heard yours. Hello? What do you want? I need help. I got an injured girl here. So? So open the gate. I need a doctor. I can, I can pay. Show me what you got. Look, there's no time. She's gonna die. Please, open the gate. I don't like your attitude. Let's come back tomorrow. Hey! Hey, hey, wait! Stop! Get out of the car! Hands up! Okay, okay. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. He has an injured girl in there. You're gonna keep him away just because he won't pay your bribe? Drake's gonna hear about this, Sophia. You've been warned. Maybe I'll tell him about that poison you call liquor you've been making in your cellar. My cellar would be a great place to hide your body. He's with me. We'll see. Can you really pay? I stuck my neck out for you. I can pay. Thanks. I'm Josh. Whatever. Follow me. faster we don't want to attract too much attention morons what's with them they're hungry mayor keeps everyone on a tight leash around here but not you keep your mind out of our business get your woman healed and move on She's not my woman. She's 16. Ah, yeah, right. Scavs kidnapped her. Her parents asked me to get her back. Is that your angle? Rescuing girls? Just try to help people where I can. <sighs> Another holy roller. What? Word of advice. Don't start preaching around here. People don't want to hear. Up there. Stab one. Or abdomen. Okay, okay. all right. Step back. Step back, please. bad is it? Not stealing it. Just not a good idea for folk to see this. care about her you're surprised I guess I mean people who care don't normally last long out there I mean, you look like you've been mobile a while I've been up north for a while up north yeah lots of folks need help up there what there's stories from up north legends about a man a roller that helps people is that you? It's everything I have. Is it enough? Mister, the wound is deep. There's a lot of damage. I don't have the skill. You're not a doctor? No. Was well, there anybody else here who can help? Not anymore. My mom is a surgeon in the town. Was? Where is she? 
She's not here. That's all you need to know. Is she alive? I don't know. Listen, we have some antibiotics, okay? It's probably enough to keep her alive for a few days. This will cover it. How many days? Three, maybe. After that, I have to ask the mayor for more. I can already tell you his answer. Do it. Where's your mother? Oh, no. Nice car. My deputy says you entered the town illegally. We take the law seriously here. I let him in, Victor. He has an injured girl in you there. Shut he your can't... mouth. Here's the way it's gonna go. You give me your keys. Then you pay a fine. Can't pay? You work. Don't do this. Keys. That's my new baby. You treat her right. What are you looking at? Huh? Go ahead. Who oh, give me a reason? Huh? She can hang tomorrow. And I'm gonna hold the rope. Feeling the life choke out of you. Get out. I don't think that's a good idea. Let me do the thinking. Josh McManus. You know, we get holy rollers through here time to time, vigilantes, crusaders, stirring up trouble, making a lot of noise about God and ignoring our laws. But you get a few drinks of them. Catch him behind closed doors, you'll see the truth. What's your point? My point. I 
I think you're the real deal. I can't help but think about all these stories I'm hearing from up north about a rider in black, a man of God, never loses a fight. I was just trying to save that girl's life. I didn't mean to cause any trouble. You entered my town illegally, attacked my deputies. Now I've got to hang you. It's law. But, as chance would have it, we both want the same thing. Grace, Sophia's mother, town doctor. You need her. So do we. Where is she? You heard of a man called the Shepherd? Yeah, I've heard of him. I'm kind of a prophet. He's a vagrant. His name's George Hillcott. Drifted through town last winter talking crazy. One day he just wandered off. I assumed he was dead, then I started hearing stories and gathering followers, performing miracles. Grace ran off to join him in the summer. We sent men to find her. Some came back empty-handed, and then some didn't come back at all. So you think that I can find him when your men couldn't? My men couldn't find hay in a haystack. But you're an experienced rider, and you're motivated. But there's something else. You know who I was before this? Nobody. I worked at the gas station. Part time. Have any desire to be in charge of anything. Then the day happened. I learned something about myself. I wasn't going to be a victim for anybody. And I killed a lot of men, thought they could steal from me, bully me. Next thing I knew, half the town was gone. The other half was looking to me for leadership. So I gave it to him. See, some of us still want to live the way we used to, not just survive. I don't have the luxury of pondering prophets or miracles, but I ain't blind either. I've seen things I can't explain. This shepherd, we've found their tracks, camps. It's like chasing ghosts. Some think he's a genuine holy man and that he can only be found by a man of faith do you think I can find him because I believe you find the shepherd you'll find grace and you'll save the girl or you can do nothing and I'll hang in the morning it's up to you You got lucky, Ryder. Next time, I'm gonna break you in half. Well, there you go, bud. Gassed up, old up. She is a beauty. 50 miles west of here. We know the shepherd and his people use this corridor, moving through, smuggling refugees, Christians across the border to Canada. I'll be back with the doctor. Don't let her die. Well, it's up to you. you're doing the perfect guy for the job comes along at exactly the right time that's something I can't ignore you find a religion on me
take the gas. Just the meat. Hi. doing? Mr. Drake, why is he taking our supplies? She's an outsider. We take care of our own first. She's gonna die. How's the signal? Satellite's online. We're in business. We got a problem. Sophia's missing. No one can find her anywhere. Did you have that car in your sight at all times? Well, yeah, sure. <laughs> Okay, well, maybe not the whole time, not now that I think on it. She's gonna ruin everything. How bad this looks, but you don't understand. You don't know what he's like. I'm his prisoner, and so was my mom until she escaped. Josh, I try to leave, but they just won't let me. You were my only out. I'm sorry. Okay. What are you doing? There's enough gas to get you back to town. What? It's ten miles that way. Don't follow me. Are you listening to me? I'm not going back there. I have to find her. I have to find her. Don't do this, okay? You can't trust him. You don't know what he's like. Josh! John, don't leave me here out of my own car! Come on! Ah! Time, Ellie. <laughs> well, I had to make it look good, huh? <laughs> Didn't I miss it? <laughs> <laughs> I know! Wayne! What would Mama say? Only take what we need. Well, come on. Can't I just drive it once? You can drive it home. <laughs> hey, we're gonna sell it a honcho. That's it. You understand? <laughs>
got a fever. She's not gonna last three days. What do we do? I don't know. Well, we took that man's payment. We have to do something. Well, what are you doing? Somebody will see it. I don't care. on a screen. Beg for your life. I'm not high on my list of things to do today. Wouldn't happen to know where I could find the shepherd, could you? Don't say that name under my roof. He'll bring a blight down on us. That's what he promised. Hell and damnation if we didn't repent. He didn't fool me. He wasn't no prophet. He was a demon. Did you know where I could find him? Mom has been wanting to cook with some new flavors. I keep telling the people around here I ain't gonna go for it. There's a car yours will bring ten times what you'll meet with. Hey! Hot Pockets. Dr. Pepper, Ben and Jerry's. This place smells. Almond Joy. Cool Whip. What? It's gone. Ain't never gonna come back. These rednecks, they give me the creeps. Why don't we just kill them and take the car? Where I'm from, you learn straight off. Can't make no money off of a dead man. Hey, one of these days you're gonna tell me where you're from, right? Right. It's none of your business where I'm from. Hello, gentlemen. you not to follow me oh okay well if you want to be dinner that's fine by me i'll just i'll leave okay find the key okay <clears throat> Easy for you to say. Mommy! What am I going to do my friend? 
soon, Mama. Real soon. It's not here. There's got to be another key ring. I'll look. They're gonna be trouble. Yeah. You don't want it? No. Okay. The car was sold to a man named Honcho. He's the boss of the local swap meet. You know him? Yeah, I know him. Charming. Where is he? We're walking. That's 30 miles from here. Looks like it. So we're a team. We'll see. Which way? That way. Hey, Josh. Yeah? I think I'm done eating meat for a while. Yeah, me too. Hi, back off! Touch these wheels on my permission. I will skin you alive and feed you to my pigs. Back off, back off. Callister Farm anymore. Huh. Looks like he's way out at Honcho's place. At the swap meet? He's going the wrong way. The swap meet. Go. And if Sophia's with him, just get rid of her. Split him up. Is that what this is about? You think he can find the shepherd because he believes it? And she'll jinx it? You just do what I tell you. I'm telling you, I can find him. It's been five months, and you ain't found him yet.
You don't talk much. So what's your story? I never met a writer who wasn't a total creep. So what is it? Did you lose someone on the day? Family? Probably. Everyone did. Wife. My daughter. They were saved. I'm, s I'm sorry. But I bet that's good, right? Because they're in heaven. Can you teach me to believe what you believe? Like, growing up, I never even went to church. <laughs> My mom just thought it was a waste of time. We had no interest in it, so. <laughs> Joke's on us, right? <laughs> what? What? Come on. Shepherd. The shepherd. My shepherd. Hey! Hey, stay back. I'll cut you. I will cut you. I'm not gonna hurt you. That's what they all say. I'm looking for the shepherd, too. You know him? Yeah. I found him. And I walked with him. And then one night I left. When I tried to come back, I, I, I couldn't, I couldn't come back. I can't control it. The devil, the devil is in my, the devil's in my brain. And I, I can't get him out. I, I can't get him out. He tells me to do things. No. They weren't, they weren't supposed to die. Oh, 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 not He's like crazy. that, not like that, not like that. Can you help me find him? I, I don't think he'll let me find him. I don't think, oh, he won't let me find him. Oh, oh it's gonna burn, it's gonna burn. Gonna... Listen to me. Jesus is there for you. He loves you. He will forgive you. Listen to me. It's okay. Here. Look. You have it. You have it. Yeah. yeah. I will give this to you. But will you help me find him? I will. But how? How do I help you find him? Okay. Uh, help. Here, 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 here. Just point out. Just point out on the map. Point out on the map where you last saw him. Just stay calm. This is where... This is where I lost him. This is where you last saw him. Yeah, right here. Okay, okay, here, 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 here. Up for yourself. Are you kidding me? They're trying to kill us. Take it. I don't need it. What? Here's the plan. I'm gonna draw the fire. No. After I leave, count to ten, then no. run for that house. Don't come out till I come get you. Wait! No! 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 One. I see him. But I'm running. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight. Where'd they go? Nine, ten. Hello. Hello. 
Hello? Is there anybody there? Hello? We'll find you. Keep this way. I say they split up. Both of you quiet. Look sharp. This Bobby. Maybe we should forget about this one. That's what he wants. But he's just me like all the rest. We're gonna find you. And your woman too. I had the chance to kill you, and I didn't. Walk away. You don't scare us. You got lucky. Not luck. This way. Bobby. I'm sorry, I didn't, I didn't know anyone was here. Oh, that's all right, dear. It's nice to see your friendly face. I don't usually get many visitors. Listen, you need to go down to your cellar and hide. Hide? What's all this about? in the woods trying to kill us. Can't you hear them? Bah, I don't care about that. <laughs> Young folks always fighting. I just love how the trees look in the winter. Aren't they lovely? Come on, we need to go downstairs. Oh, all right. What's your name? <laughs> Beatrice. They call me Aunt B on account of I never <laughs> did take a husband. <laughs> I suppose I regret never having children. <laughs> I was a midwife, you know. I saw so many die in childbirth. I guess it put me off the idea. The good Lord was the only husband I ever needed. Aunt B? Do I know you? It's nice to see a friendly face. I don't get many visitors. Huh? Why are you still here? Didn't you hear him call? Who? Jesus! I don't think so. No, I don't know. You don't know? Well, you better start listening. It's almost time. What do you mean? Time for what? Why? The end.
Tell me, how do I hear him? If you seek him, you'll hear him. Jesus is the door. If anyone enters through him, ye shall be saved. I don't understand. Are you simple, girl? Don't you know your verses? It's all in the Bible. In the good book. I'm coming, Lord. I hear you. I do love how the woods smell in the wintertime. Don't they look lovely? Vehicle's here. There's no sign of the rider or Sophia. What do you want? The owner of this vehicle, where is he? Well, you're looking at him. Where did you get it? The previous owner, is he still alive? I ain't got to tell you nothing. Let me talk to him. Listen, Parasite. I allow your gathering in my county because you serve a purpose. Now I serve your purpose. You listen to me. This is the wild, all right? This is my world. If you hide behind your walls, like the lapdog you are, because we are free men here! Yeah! Don't be stupid. Without gasoline, you're finished. You have nothing. Well, maybe I stop letting your boys come around here. No more playtime, no more, no more fun, I don't think you want that. What's it worth to you? Two barrels. Done. <laughs> I should have asked for more. OK, straight up. I bought this car from them weird rednecks out at the farm. That's it. Go talk to them. <laughs> Come on, let's go party. Come on. Where to, boss? The farm? No. No, he's still alive. Those McAllisters would have gotten the better of him. He's still alive, and he'll be coming for his car. You still have your guy there? Yeah. He'll do anything you want for a price. OK. Pull back. We don't want a battle. Give your guy a cell and have him watch the car. If Sophia is with Josh, make sure she doesn't leave with him. Kill her if you have to. Turn the other cheek. He said that, right? Yeah. So what if someone's trying to kill you? I'm still working on that. Sometimes it seems like we have no choice. Fight or die. But when you believe, when you truly believe, 
There's always a choice. Death isn't the end. You're not afraid to die? No. I know I'm going to a better place. That shouldn't be hard. How can God allow all this to happen? How can he permit so much suffering? And now we see the truth. Now that his hand is gone, his light, his love. We see what the world is really like without him. Nothing to restrain the selfishness, the evil. But if you know you're going to a good place, then why do you still fight? Because of you. For everyone who's still out there, there's still a chance. I can help them. I can help them find the bridge. And that's worth fighting for. You're a good man. I almost forgot what we're looking. You might be the last one on earth. Josh? Josh isn't here, dude. Where is Josh? He's out there somewhere trying to find help. Keep fighting, you're gonna get through this. <sighs> Josh. Josh can look after himself, Breath. You don't understand. He's important. He's going to do something. What's he going to do? A man told me Josh is going to do. I can't remember. Maybe it was just a dream. He showed me a hammer. A witness, a man in white, a moving city, a broken sphere, a golden bridge, endless fire, a throne of light. So many people deny the day. Say it didn't happen, it was a solar flare or something. We're not even supposed to talk about it, especially not when those ULC creeps are around. And I'm not stupid. I know what I saw. I was in Denver, downtown at a music festival, and there were thousands of people in the streets, so they had to block it off. I was on a double date with Brian, my boyfriend, and my mom and her new friend. <laughs> I forget his name. And then all of a sudden, this light filled the sky. And at first we thought it was part of the show. Then we knew it was something different. It moved through you. Knowing every single part of you. And there was this sound, like a, a bomb or an earthquake. And people panicked. They, they went everywhere. It was crazy. That was, that was the first time I had ever seen someone die. And then I saw them. I saw them, people glowing from within. They weren't afraid at all. They vanished. 
into a single speck of light and, and flew away. What about you? Where were you on the day? Small town. Had some trouble with the biker gang. And I killed a few of them. Does the day go by when people aren't trying to kill you? <laughs> the next day I found the Lord. A little late. Teach me. Please. I'm not the guy you want. Maybe the shepherd can. But I'm asking you. I mean, I can, I can tell you what it says in here, but it's up to you to believe. So what does it say? Well, Jesus is speaking here. He says, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father but through me. You're... No, I don't understand. I... I want you to start at the beginning. Can you teach me everything? All right. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. And the earth was formless and empty. thing to remember is that salvation can't be bought or earned like it was some kind of a prize. It's a relationship. It's, it's through faith, through devotion, through his sacrificial blood on the cross that opened the door to heaven for us. But we still have to accept. I resisted for a long time didn't think that he could love someone like me. Certainly didn't think that he would die for someone who did the things that I did. But I was wrong. He can. And he did. Does that make sense? More than you know. We're here. Stay close. Mamma mia. You're Drake's girl. What are you doing off the reservation, sweetie? Easy. She's with me. Ah! Hey, idiot! Stop him! You're in trouble now, bucko. Just watch out now, huh? <laughs> Hey! 
you have to go bust up my party, huh? I had a pretty bullet in you. My car. Oh, correction, that is my car. Find his keepers, man. You want it, you have to trade. It was stolen. I don't have anything to trade. <laughs> what you do? Oh, yes, you do. I've had my eye on this one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I could get a very good place for out west in the king's territories. I'm not for sale. Huh. Well, then we're done here. No deal. Bye-bye. Oh, unless. Unless what? Well, you're a good fighter. And Hancho knows how to make money. Show. It's pretty good, though, right? Yeah, I guess. No, it, it's it's good. So I was the uh, drama coach at St. Charles Community College. Yeah. See, an accent makes you mysterious, dangerous. Got a good feeling about you, about us working together. Look, I just want to get this over with and get out of here. Who do you got to be in such a hurry? There's a fortune to be made here. See, I run it all. A little girl is dying and you're wasting my time with games. I'm looking for a doctor. Sophia's mother. Grace? I thought she died. Who told you that? Or disappeared? I don't know. What am I, the village gossip? Just beat these chumps. Okay, no more back. Day here in 
in the pit. Some of you bet against Poncho's man, and now we're regretting it. But because our host is so generous, he has scheduled one more match to determine his true champion, a chance to win back your credit! We had a deal, Honcho. And we still do. You win a tournament, you win the car. But the tournament's not over yet, bro. Three men and ladies of the borderland. It's the Black Rider versus the Beast. Where do you think you're going? We're done here. No, no, no. We're just getting started. Hey. Get out of the car, man. You can't go without these. Hey, why are you standing around like idiots? Go get them! Movement. Oh no. No, no, no! What? We're leaking fuel. How far is the Shepherd's camp? I don't know. No one knows where it is. Here, that guy. Put a mark on the map. Josh, that guy was crazy. Just look. It's about 20 miles from here. We're not gonna make it. Well, can you catch it? <sighs> There's no time. You did everything you could, Josh. More than anyone else would have. No, I didn't. You're right. 
I put limits on myself. Josh, where did you get that? Josh! Josh, there is always a better way. You taught me that, and it's true. Josh, you taught me how to find peace, to not be afraid, not even of dying. Violence, anger, revenge, that'll, that'll lead you away from it. You don't want to do this. Josh, because of you, I believe. I believe Jesus died for us. I believe he protects us, and he makes a way. Believe that too. Don't lose your faith. What's going on? Why aren't they stopping? It's like they can't even see us. Would you like to meet the ship? Yes. Yes, please. Follow me. What about the car? All will be provided for. Don't worry. system up. Eat, drink, you have plenty. Mm. Where'd you get these? I thought these died out. Hey, nice to meet you. Here. What's happening here? I don't know whether to be happy or worried. Be glad. This is as the Lord wants us to be. So it was once, so shall it be again. Oh, wow. This is incredible. How are these growing so well? You're back. Looks like you found what you were looking for. Welcome. I'm Raul. I'm the mechanic around here. We got up without saying a word and just wandered onto the prairie. At this point, we're used to it. He's a shepherd. That's what they say. But to us, he's Brother George. He's always where he needs to be. I don't know how he knows, but he does. I don't know myself. I just have a feeling of what I'm supposed to do, and I do it. This morning I was reading and praying for guidance how I how I was going to reach the coast and I had this sudden urge to walk out onto the highway and there I found brother Joshua and sister Sophia you know our names you told me didn't you no oh i uh i guess i just know brother raul would you please tow Brother Josh's car back to camp? I, 
I have a feeling. Huh. George. George, can you help my plant? I've tried everything. It's dying. Okay. Come back later. Sorry. I'm sure you have many questions. Yes. My mother, Grace, is she here? Grace? There's no one here by that name. What? What? No. No, no. That's impossible. She looks like me. She's my height. She's in her 60s. She's a doctor. I know all of my people. She's not here. What is this? What do you want? To get paid? She's here. We were told she's here. We need her. A girl's life is at stake. I'm sorry. Someone told you she was here. Who was it? Was this person trustworthy? I don't believe it. I don't understand. Why would he lie about this? If she's not here, then where is she? Oh my. Oh. Jo Josh! Jo Josh, look. Look. What? That's impossible. How did, how did you do that? How did you do that? I really don't know. I pray for sick things to heal, and they do. I pray for small things to grow, and they do. I pray for evil to stay away, and it does. Can you do that for a person? Yes. There's a girl who's dying in town. Can you help us? I figured there was a reason God brought us together. You need something from me, and I need something from you. What do you need? Forgive me. Forgive me. I, uh, I should explain. I was in a coma, result of a life of bad choices, drugs, crime, prison. I was not a nice man. I was not supposed to wake up, but I did. On the day, I heard a voice and I saw a light. A light that, that's still there on the edge of my sight. A choir that's always on the edge of my hearing. A warmth that I can almost feel when, when I reach out my hand. Since I woke up, the memories of my life are slipping away and replaced by wonderful visions from the Lord, people, places, journeys to faraway lands from, from different times. I saw the deserts of Egypt like I was there. I saw the first temple of Jerusalem. It was like I was sitting at the table with Jesus and, and his disciples. I remember their faces. I know languages I've never learned. I need you to help me follow his call, Josh. I've stayed here, helping people best I can, waiting for what comes next. And last week, the call came again, the urge. I have to go back to the Holy Land. There's another one out there just like me somewhere. And together, we will meet in Jerusalem and we must bear witness to what happens there. You want me to take you to the Middle East? No. Just to the coast. God will provide me safe passage from there. But you'll stop in town first. Uh. I doubt if it's going to be that easy. But I will go.
What time is it? Almost sundown. That can't be right. How long were we in there? Time moves a bit strange around Brother George. You get used to it. He's got a leak. Not anymore. It's all patched up. She's a beauty. You mind if I take a look under the hood? Sure, go ahead. If I didn't see with my own eyes, I wouldn't have believed it. Yeah, me too. Does it say anything about this in the scriptures? It talks about two witnesses in the book of Revelation. But it doesn't really specify as to who they are, just that they're prophets with the power of God. It says there are two olive trees and two lampstands, and they stand before the Lord of the earth. Lord of the earth? Satan, devil. They're supposed to preach to the people, the world, and their words will be like fire, and, and they'll kill anyone who tries to harm them. And then the beast will rise up and destroy them. Come here. I thought I had problems. <laughs> you okay? I'm sorry about your mother. I just don't know if she's alive or dead. Your people, they're, they're leaving. We knew this day would come. Don't worry. They'll be safe. Found this on the inside of your fender. What's it for? Oh, no. What is it? He never wanted us to bring back your mother. What do you mean? I'm here. There's no need for violence. What? I surrender. No, you can't. Is it him? It's all right, Brother Joshua. It's all right. It's him. Get him in the truck. He's not going anywhere with you. Oh, will you please shut up? <laughs> Brother Joshua. <laughs> A faith in God's play. A faith in God's play. A faith. Faith in God's play. Search the building. Kill anything that moves. Starting with him. Call the ULC. Tell them that I have what they want. Nobody home. Place clear. Let's go. Bring the car. We're moving out! Where is she? Where is my mother? I'm your hey! They're on the way. No one sleeps tonight. Nobody comes in or out of here for any reason. Don't take your eyes off him. Nothing's gonna happen. Don't do this, please. I've seen what he can do, Abner. It's the real thing. It's not a trick. You have to let him go. I remember a girl crawled to my doorstep, willing to do anything for a roof over her head, a hot meal, and I took you in, you and your mother. And this is the thanks I get. Where is she? Is she still alive? Will things go back to normal? Will you do as you're told?
The ULC needed surgeons after the war. I sent her to them. She's still alive as far as I know. I'm sorry I lied to you. It was necessary. Joshua. Joshua. I'm with you, Joshua. How? How is? Who are you? You know me, Joshua. You are. That's not possible. It, you wouldn't. Well, it, it says that peace. I've not returned yet. That time is still coming. You can help me. You can do anything. I can. But in the right time and for the right reason. The shepherd, he touched me. He, he prayed for me. Can he really heal? Only God can heal, Joshua. The witness is an instrument. By God's hand through him, that which seems impossible can become possible. The choice is yours. I have a choice. There's always a choice. Does that mean that I can, I can see them again? Rachel. Rachel. And, and your daughter. And your parents are waiting for you. All you have to do is take my hand. But they need me here. If I don't help them, how will they? The shepherd, he's, he's part of the prophecy. Son. He, have no fear, the prophecies will be fulfilled, be it one way or another. One river is calm while the other is treacherous. In one boat, many will be saved. In the other, many will be lost. Maybe I, maybe I don't want the responsibility. I'm tired of fighting. Never enough for everyone that I save. A hundred or... It matters a great deal to that one person. It matters to me. Help me, Lord. What do I do? Someone's coming. Ignore them. No one gets in today. It ain't slowing down. I don't like this. How much longer? Judge down in about 30 minutes.
Life is only temporary, Mr. Drake. Remember that. Do not store up for yourselves treasures on earth where moth and rust destroy and where thieves break in and steal. But store up for yourselves treasures in heaven. Shut up! Just shut up. Hey, come here. Help out. What happened? Are you crazy? Drake will have me hanged. Then I'll do it. Anything's better than just watching her die. Molly, don't go do something stupid. I mean, she's not even one of us. She's an outsider. Josh, did you find Grace? No, but I found somebody the better. How is she? She's not good. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. Let her die. They'll be here in five minutes. Time to go. Get him ready. You're not gonna give me any problems, right, holy man? Not the kind you would understand. Injectors have all been cut. These ladies won't be rolling for weeks. McManus? Thought you said you took care of him. I put two in his chest. He was dead. Send the shepherd to me. Doesn't look very dead to me. Shoot him! <laughs> Shoot him! Where is everybody? No more backup, Drake. It's over. You think this is over? You have no idea who you're dealing with. Come on. Let's go. Move. Abner, stop. Whatever they're paying you, it's not worth it. Please just let him go. Start it up. Boss, she is not ready yet. Start it up. Everybody inside. Airfield.
zombies? Yeah, barely. <sighs> They're taking me to the airfield. Here, take it. No complaints. Keep your hands up. I don't know who you are, but you have no idea what you're involving yourselves in. You can't have him. Not today. Not ever. Be sensible. We can make this worth your while. You were wrong to think you could change the prophecies. I don't know what you're talking about. I suggest you find a very deep hole to hide in. The chairman will hear about this. He'll hear about you. Is it working? She's fading. Well, she can't be. You, you did it for me. Why? Why? Why isn't it working? I, I, I've done all I can. As, as far as I understand it, the rest is up to him. He fought so hard for me. My parents will miss me so much, and I'll miss them. I should go back. But you don't want to go back. No. I want to go with you, Lord. You have a gentle spirit. These end of times are hard times. Filled with sadness. Will they be okay? Worry no longer for the world, child. Come with me. I don't understand. I don't understand. There's a captain with a cargo ship, and he's willing to take us across. Good. You're not coming, are you? You could... 
stay with me. That'd be nice. But I have to do this. I have to go there with him. I want to be a part of it. Come with us. Something tells me I should stay. And I think I should listen. Stay with me. Thank you. Don't be dangerous. I'm not afraid. You need something? Josh McManus. You're a hard man to find. I'm gonna need your help. Mm -hmm. 